making a left turn. You need to turn, and I'm looking, you need to turn into the nearest lane and that is by the double yellow. That's a good turn, okay? Let's make a left-hand turn into this private drive. My blinker's on 100 feet, half a block. I remember there was an accident here about three years ago. I'm in, I squeeze my brakes. I wanna see the rear of the tires. These lanes are for turning left only. Okay, here's my gap. I'm checking traffic. I turn hand over hand in. Imagine if I spun the wheel, I would lose control and go over the curb. Now I'm looking forward. I'm checking parking lots are very dangerous too. You can tell by my voice. I'm looking and I'm turning hand over hand out. So I have really good steering control and you see me looking and I'm turning and I'm looking, I'm checking always looking around and I'm turning this wheel and I'm looking, I see the two white cars, I look to the left. You gotta be able to do two or three things at one time and go up to the edge. So it's really important that you watch this content and learn from it. The hazard is this person carrying the wood. I don't wanna be behind them. So I'm gonna wait right here. So I'm going up to the edge. You have to stop at the stop sign. A lot of beginning drivers, oh, I've stopped, and then they roll out in front of traffic. That is the driving error, and that's dangerous. So I'm going up to the edge. What is the perceived risk? I didn't look, I didn't check. Here's the open gap. I turn into the nearest lane. Always turn into the nearest lane. It facilitates a smoother flow of traffic. I'm gonna make a lane change to the left. Mirror, turn signal, blind spot. I wanna see the rear of the tires on the ground. I don't know if I told you this, but my nephew got rear-ended and he had the second collision with the vehicle ahead. Uh, this person raises goats. I'm not mad, but I have space. If I get rear-ended, then I just have one collision. If I'm too close to this vehicle, I have two, and then I have a goat fence sign in my face. This guy has a tenant window, it's hard to see. So I'm taking my time, I'm looking and I'm scanning. Because he, humans error, and to error is to run a light at the intersection. Notice I'm keeping my space from this person carrying the fence with the goat on there, okay? Uh, it was raining briefly, the water still could be on the ground. People can lose traction. Notice both of my hands are on the wheel. I'm not up here jerking the wheel. My hands aren't at the bottom, making it small. I'm not doing a one hand thing or holding the wheel on the left. I have both hands on the wheel. I'm smooth, I have good speed control. This has been perceived risk. This is next in the series. This is the next one. I will definitely put it up for you. Thank you. If this brought you value, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I'm a state certified instructor. Uh, hopefully this helps you. Have a great day.